The Voice, Nick Jonas gains former Apple Store worker Bradley Sinclair as blind auditions continue. Nick Jonas landed a former Apple Store worker for his team on Tuesday's episode of The Voice as the blind auditions continued on the NBC singing competition show. The 28-year-old judge beat out Kelly Clarkson, 38, who turned her red chair first for Rockford, Michigan native Bradley Sinclair, 22, who currently lives in Nashville, Tennessee. Bradley in a pre-recorded video shared that he started singing at age 12 and always had a knack for technology. For the last year, I was working for Apple. I would say the silliest question that I ever got while working at the Apple store was one that I got a lot, and it was, what is the password to unlock my iPhone? I don't know. You made it, Bradley laughed. Bradley said he loved working for Apple, but also has loved music since he was in diapers and recently quit his job to pursue his singing dreams in Nashville. Getting one of these coaches to believe in me would just be huge at this point in my life, Bradley said before taking the stage. Bradley performed Say You Won't Let Go by English singer James Arthur, 33, wearing a brown turtleneck, matching pants, thin gray jacket and glasses and got both Kelly and Nick to turn. Nick recognized the song and told Bradley that he loved his rendition. You've got an amazing foundation vocally to build on, and I would be honored to be your coach. I think we'd have a lot of fun together, Nick said. Can we sing some old school Jonas Brothers stuff, Bradley asked him. Oh, you know it, Nick replied. And I just lost, Kelly quipped. John Legend, 42, praised Bradley for his range and asked about his hometown of Rockford. Bradley told him it was near Grand Rapids and shared that he met one of John's backup singers at the Apple store when he sold him an Apple watch. Your outfit looks like you work for Apple, kind of, John joked. And that's a compliment, Bradley replied. Kelly tried to woo Bradley with a team jacket, but he picked Nick as his coach. The season 20 show opened with Connor Christian, 23, of Gallipolis, Ohio, who rocked out to Bright Lights by Gary Clark Jr. Blake Shelton, 44, turned his chair first for Connor, followed by John and Kelly. Connor picked Blake and promised his coach that he was just getting started. Jihanna Zoe, 17, of Redlands, California, impressed with her cover of She Used to Be Mine by Sarah Bareilles and got chair turns from Kelly and Nick. She picked Kelly to be her coach as her mother Tia looked on with pride. Singer and one-man band J.D. Casper of Austin, Texas, performed How to Save a Life by the Fray and landed on Kelly's team after she was the only judge to turn he chair for him. The one-hour show ended with Dionne Warren, 28, from Conway, North Carolina singing Shallow by Lady Gaga and Bradley Cooper. John, Kelly, and Nick all turned their chairs for Dion, who has been working as a probation officer for nearly five years. Dion picked John to be his coach and was serenaded with a song by the 11-time Grammy winner as coaches kept their distance from contestants due to the coronavirus pandemic. Caitlin Myers, 17, of Pennsylvania, performed If You Really Love Me by Stevie Wonder and failed to get any of the judges to turn their chairs.